So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and welcome to the Watson Scott test. See what I did there? Because the name's on Okay, this is a game that caught my interest quite a lot a few days ago, and actually a load of you guys have been requesting that I check it out as well. It seems to be like a psychological horror survey type thing, like, I don't know how it's gonna work. I've stayed away from all videos on the game, so, like, I'm clueless. I don't know. I figured that we'd go ahead and check this thing out together because it looks like a very, very unique experience, and it's probably full of spooks as well. I'm gonna apologize as well, guys, ahead of time because I'm currently still a little bit sick, and uh, actually, hold up a sec. Guys, uh... It's been two days and I'm still very, very sick. However, I wanted to bring you guys a video despite me feeling really sick. <laughs> so, see what I mean? So I went down to the doctor to try and get a cure for this and the cure. 10,000 likes, guys. If you care, like video, you know? <laughs> I'm having like a fever dream with this intro. Look, let's just get on with the game, okay? <laughs> let's go ahead and start the test though, guys. I'm ready. Let's go ahead and do this. Who am I speaking to? It's uh, kind of like Simulacra, I guess. This test is designed to help you understand your deepest anxieties and the underlying causes of your darkest fears. Do I want to continue this? Heck yes. For each question, select the... It's going to be one of these slow reading things, I guess. Select the response which gives the best and most truthful an answer. <laughs> At the end of the examination, you will receive your analysis and a certificate of participation. You know, I'm actually gonna let the text do its thing. I feel like this is actually adding so far to how I'm feeling. Please note that typically only 13% of participants are able to complete the test due to the onset of total body par- uh -huh. What the freak? Or unanticipated cardiac arrest resulting in death? Do you wish to continue? Uh, heck yeah, dude. <laughs> Firstly, some calibration questions. Oh boy. Is this about my own personal calibration though? How many minutes are there in one hour? Well, that would be 60 right there, my dude. So thank you very much for that. If there are three oranges and I take away two, it's gonna say how many are left? I mean, still technically three? You know, that's what I'm trying to think. I mean, how are we speaking about this? Like in the context of the question or overall? I mean, it's not specific enough to know. So I'm gonna say infinity right now. Oh, for God's sake. Uh, okay, why is this going amber? Not, not quite. quite. What I expected. You're a freaking robot. You're programmed to understand one thing, surely? Interesting. So it's almost like the game we're playing has a conscience right now? Talking of which, are you playing a game right now? Uh, look, I bought the thing on Steam packaged in a nice bundle, okay? It's what I'm playing, I think. Anyway, are you sure it's a game? Now, this is strange so far. How is this about to make me doubt my own thoughts? That's really interesting. I mean, uh, it is a game. I'm playing it, so yeah. Okay, why is the thing on red around the edges? The freak calibration complete? Your test will be- We hadn't even began the test. What was that calibration all about? This is weird, but here we go. It's raining outside and you're walking in bare feet. You take one step forward and crush a snail between your toe. Ah, oh, dude, what the freak are we doing that for? You feel satisfied. Guilty, jealous, disgusted, or nothing. Bruh. Why would we feel jealous? What the frick? Dude, if it rains outside and you see me looking at the floor, I'm not just doing that because I don't want to make eye contact. I don't want to crush a sail. I would feel guilty as freak, you know? Ending a life just because I want to get from one destination to another. Right, what's this next one here? That's what the freak? I don't know what that just modeled to. Let's keep going though. A small child is walking down the street with a large ice cream in her hand. She trips and falls, dropping her treat onto the ground. You feel pleased, sympathetic, depressed, amused or nothing. Kind of sympathetic, you know? I mean, why would I feel like a I guess it might be funny to some, depends the circumstance. Your pet cat drops a dead mouse on your front doorstep. Bro, I already know the feeling here. Its front legs are missing. You've. This is so str- I'm literally getting fuzzes throughout my body. I've never played a game like this. You feel proud, disgusted, pleased, sad, concerned. I would feel extremely sad, you know, and also disgusted. Let's go sad though. Kind of combines the two emotions together, I feel, to an extent. Bro, what the freak is that face there? Heck, now I will show you an image. Please study it. All right, let's go. What? Bro, that mask is making me feel so... Okay, clowns, perhaps? Oh. You said the image wouldn't move, it's like glitching out. All right, how did the image make you feel? Calm, terrified, anxious, resentful. I guess a little anxious, if anything, because I was looking for the faces amongst it. You know, humans have a tendency to do that. Always looking for faces, and people say that's why we see go- What the freak, dude? This is freaking me out. <laughs> now, I'm a strong believer in something. I don't know what it is. 
So I'm gonna say yes for that one. Let's continue. That was so weird. Have you ever seen a ghost? Like, again, I was just saying about the human mind tricking you, but it's hard to tell. Like, you know, we all have our strange encounters in life. I'm gonna say yes for that one, you know? Skeptics, everyone else, like, I, I feel you, you know? Everyone's got their own opinion. Thinking about the room you're in right now, has anyone ever... <sighs> this is weird. This is literally making my eyes water. This is just strange questions, right? Plus, I'm like fevering out, guys. I don't know what I'm feeling right now. I think the house I live in is like a post-World War II build. So, I'm gonna have to say unsure. House has been around for a long time, which creeps me out. Just... Uh-oh. What you thinking about, huh? Very... Atypical? Results? What? Please indicate how strongly you agree or disagree. Okay, let's have a look. So it's gonna list some statements, here we go. Sometimes I see things that aren't really there. Strongly disagree, disagree, agree, strongly agree. I'm gonna go agree for that one. You know, the mind plays tricks. It's just how the mind works. I often think about the ghosts inside- oh. oh, this is weird. Okay, look, keep in the zone, it's just a quiz. Ah, uh, I mean, I do, because I'm alone a lot of the time and the paranoia just kicks in. Agree? I guess? Give me that next question. It's gonna follow up though, isn't it? I take pleasure in seeing- other people in pain. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna have to agree with that one, Chief. Wait, what? I meant strongly disagree, all right? That is not... <laughs> Stop, game. I would know if someone was inside my house preparing to kill me while I was... Don't look behind you, bro. Oh, my God. This is weird, but I'm into this. Look, whoever's running this test, okay, if you break into my house, all right, I'm gonna break your neck. There is an unexpected guest in my house. Look, bro, strongly disagree. Don't do it. Don't do it. No jump scares. Oh, nobody would know. Nobody would know if I went missing. Strongly disagree, I guess. Like, I got you guys, right? Keep it going. Come on, it's thinking. Poetry is the most intelligent form of artistic. The freak was that expression. Can be pretty artistic, so I guess I'll agree to an extent with that one, yeah? <coughs> Correct. All right. I've designed a new algorithm for generating insightful poetry. Okay. Here's one. Stop glitching out. Just tell me the point. Here's one I just wrote. Far away, my dude. Far away. Roses are red. You didn't write this, you liar. Silent as a mouse. Okay. Your door. Don't do this crap. I'm inside your house. Oh. <laughs> this is cool, but extremely bizarre. I'm in on this. Congratulations. Only 41% of participants typically reach this point. From now on, the questions will be much more intense. So they weren't before. Do you wish to continue? <sighs> yeah, hold on. I'm going to check my doors lock. Give me a sec. We're going to continue anyway. Oh, boy. How far away? It's the closest police station. Uh, next door? As far as you know? More than a 15 minute walk? Unfortunately. It's not about the walk though, right? They got speedy, uh, you know, blue and red lights and stuff like that. How well do you know your neighbors? I don't know my neighbors at all. We're acquaintances. I'll go with that one, you know? You gotta keep... Who the freak is walking behind my back right now? Can you guys look for me? How long can you hold your breath underwater? Less than 41 seconds. No. Don't do that. This is something I have no idea. Let's go mid-ground. I don't know. What is the average for holding your breath? Imagine you finish this test and you're lying in bed tonight. What is with the sounds in the back, though? Attempting to sleep. Can we just get to the point, Mr. Robot? You understand that I'm inside your house and you hear me underneath your bed. You. You get up and look under the bed and I stab you in the eyes. Try to pretend you can't hear me or feel my presence, but then I stab you in the eyes. Fall asleep knowing that you'll wake up to me stabbing you in the eyes. Or <gasps> what the frick? What kind of question is this crap? I guess I would do the top one. I would try to figure out what the problem is, whether or not it ends bad. I wouldn't know by that point. So uh, look, I wouldn't allow you to stab me in the eyes, but the way that question's worded, uh, you know, I, I have no choice. You and your closest friend are stranded on a remote desert island after your plane crashed in the ocean. The nearest ship that can help you will arrive in one week. You have one more day of food and water before you will both die of starvation. Are you serious right now? There is no other food around. Do you? I- oh, This is getting weird. That's no hard feelings, okay? Murder my second closest friend out of boredom and then wait to die. Wait until food runs out and then murder my second closest friend out of spite. Ration the food and attempt to survive straight up. Look, it's gonna be that one. This is the one I would do right there. Try and ration the food. I will now show you an image. We're back to this then, huh? 
please study it carefully. It's probably going to say, and then it won't move at all. Wait, the image will not speak? Well, it's an image. I sure hope not. Hey, I feel spiders in this one. What's... I don't know what... Okay, that's like the face of the spider in the middle. Okay. Oh, boy. I feel so weird right now. How did that image make you feel? A bit uneasy, but the sound is doing... The freak was that? I said the word uneasy straight away. Yep. This is making me feel all kinds of strange right now. I don't mind spiders, but, you know, that was like a jacked up one that was mirrored like 28 times. So, uh, yeah, kind of mind that. I will ask this one more time. Are you playing a game right now? Is there a right answer? You know, you could say yes, but this is more of like a survey slash test. That's not so much a game. I'm going to say no. You know, I want to see what the thing says to that. Do you know that I'm a good person? Bro, you're a sentient robot, so like, I don't know. You're asking me some strange questions, and I've known you about 14 minutes, so... I guess I'll say no. I don't know you. I don't know anything about this still. Are, Are you lying, lying to me right, right now? No for that one. Gotta continue through. Let's keep battling on through. Lying is forbidden. Yeah, you're dang right. Please select any of the following. <sighs> Dude, the sound is too high. I'm gonna have to turn this down. Wrestling, jujitsu, mixed martial arts, taekwondo, and none of the above. Uh, I did do Taekwondo for a while when I was younger, so we're gonna go that one right there. By the way, Black Belt, please select any of the following industries that you have occupational experience with. Law enforcement, private security detail, mercenary, military, or none of the above. None of the above? That's probably the worst thing to tell this robot right now. It's kind of feeding off of that, it seems. How many fingers am I holding up right now? Look behind you, there's nobody behind me. I'm gonna commit, guys. There is no one behind me. Choose the word that is most similar to appropriate. Murder, baby, death, innocent, or chasm. I, I don't know. Seriously, none of them feel remotely similar or most similar, even though that's what the question is asking. I don't know. I really don't know. I guess I'm going to say innocent. I really don't know what else to answer with that question. Wait, hold up a sec. Your recent answers indicate that you are exhibiting a flight or fight response and maybe at risk of an acute stress reaction. I'll need you to breathe slowly and calm down. All right. Press continue when you are calm. Bro, I'm as calm as I'm going to be through this test. Let's What? Let's go. Let's just keep going. I feel like something is just going to, like, bounce out at any moment. Please take a moment. Look away from your monitor and observe the nearest exit. Straight there, right there. Okay, dude, make sure you could run if something were to happen. Do this now. No, I, I can't run. It's, there's a chair in the way. Okay, we're gonna keep going with this one. Did you look away from your screen? I mean, I did. I did indeed, so yeah. <laughs> look at that last answer though. Look, I ain't gonna be savvy with this beast right now inside my computer. I'm gonna pass. Do you think I can tell when you look away from your screen? I mean, I unplugged my webcam, so maybe going on judgment of what everyone else would have been doing, you know? Do you feel safe in your house right now? Yes, I do. So, there is no yes. I guess I'll have to see on shore. Now this robot is planting direct seed straight in my head. Are you having fun? I mean, uh, you know. Gonna be honest, feeling a bit unsure with that one. I know when you're lying to me, I read that. So you can type quick, but you choose not to. Please ignore any external stimulus. Concentrate only on this screen. There are no unexpected guests in your house. There are no unusual sounds coming from inside your house. Do not take your eyes off the screen. This is making me really nervous. Do you understand? I guess. So let's go. Lo hey, bro, you don't know me. Do you understand? Yes. If I okay, I didn't even get a chance to read that one. Music can help us all relax. Singing is relaxing. What do you... Wh okay, I can't read this. Up and down the city road, in and out the eagle. Okay, this is just getting so bizarre right now. This sound is ridiculous. If you guys are wearing headphones, you hear it too. Oh boy. Like, get your crap done, all right? You're having a moment. We all have them. Don't do it. This is the weirdest sounding thing I've ever heard. It's literally right behind my left ear right here, guys, okay? Don't look behind. Keep focus on the screen. Keep going. Ah! Watson's- ah!
Nearly survived. I feel about dead right now. I lasted 29 minutes and 5 seconds. My analysis knows what others are feeling by looking at them. Susceptible to the influence of powerful people. People remember my face? Okay, so that's not, I guess, the worst list of things, though I really have no idea. When stranded on a remote island, I would ration the food and attempt to survive. Okay, that's exactly what I said. I'm most afraid of dying alone. I mean, uh, that was really, really cool. I seriously enjoy- is it over? Hold up, the main test is complete. There is a bonus test available. It's gonna ask me if I wanna do it, isn't it? Oh yeah, would you like to take it? Kind of feeling like I got no choice right now, so uh, let's go ahead and do this. What other questions have you got for me? Very well. Yeah, very well indeed. This second test is designed to challenge your fear, tolerance. Incorrect answers will be punished. Ignorance will be punished. Okay. I must also admit that I have not run this test before. Uh-oh. There may be unexpected malfunctions. Your answers will be used in the development of future tests. Let's go, dude. I'm down for your crappy test. Let's go ahead and conquer this thing. Complete this test as quickly as possible for accurate results. All right. I got that many seconds left, though it's ticking down pretty quick. But do not let that clock concern you. It is nothing to be concerned about. All right, let's go. Far away. After the examination, you will have a better sense of purpose and a stronger resolve. I want you to be stronger. Do you want to be stronger? Yes! I guess so. May as well say yes. Let's begin. The moment I've been waiting for. How many bones are there in a newborn baby that I haven't met yet? Okay, I have no idea what this is, so I'm just going to shoot this answer here. I know the newborn baby has more. How do you know it's correct, though, if you've never met a newborn baby? You know what I'm saying? Zero, one, one, two. What's next? Uh, I would imagine a two. Though it could be two threes. So, uh, I don't really know. Apparently, uh, that is correct. All right. Do you think you're smart? Mm, not particularly. I guess I'll say, okay. don't punish me. Don't punish me. You, what? You're not special. You, you want to fight me? You freaking okay, what's it doing now? What is this crap? You're firing numbers at me. Journalism. Obtainable. You? Exotic. That's me, alright? Yes. Okay, thanks. Yes, gather mean peace frantic. I'm going frantic right now. I don't know. What is the right answer? In English, not in computer crap. See? You are not smart enough. Alright. Okay. How many times per year does the average human heart beat if it is not st- What the freak are you talking about? I don't know what this answer would be. Probably about 13 million, right? I would say closer to 30 million, to be honest. That sounds a bit more logical. All right, correct. Good stuff. One of the most venomous land snakes in Australia, the Death Adder. Uh, I can't stress it. Bites an adult woman, injecting a highly deadly neurotoxin. How long does the woman have to live? I think it's a fairly quick process, so maybe one hour? I'm more drawn to 24 minutes. Nope. Okay, I'm incorrect. I, I don't know. A man is tied to a chair against his will, and a funnel is placed inside his mouth. Pulverized pig intestines are poured in. How much volume does the man's stomach hold before it ruptures? Maybe, uh, I don't know, one liter? Maybe 1.5? I don't know. What the freak are these questions? This is so bizarre. Okay, continue. A fear of butterflies is called, uh, uh sibiophobia. What? Uh, how am I supposed to know? I know it's not the last one. Okay, I'll go that one then. Incorrect. I don't know. Oh, oh God, he knows though. It's kind of mad because, uh, you know, I messed up that question. A boy with no arms is facing west. He walks forward for 60 seconds and then turns 90 degrees left. He sees someone running at him. So he turns 180 degrees and begins to run. Which way is the boy facing? Okay, so it was west, then he walked forward. Uh, so he'd be facing south, right? What the freak is this question? How do tapeworms enter their hosts? Uh, airborne tapeworm, burrowing through the skin, bites from infected mosquitoes, sores or open wounds in the flesh, larvae in... I, 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 I don't really understand what the freak these questions are. I'm gonna go that one. I don't really understand and I don't want to know how a tapeworm gets in the body. Can you stop banging my door, by the way? Please choose the third response. This is not a trick. I will not scare you if you do what I say. All right, well, hurry up because the time is ticking down. I will scare you. I will not scare you. I am lying. Okay. Correct. Why is he saying death in the top corner right now? Can we be done? You know? What is a positive electrode cord? Uh, anode, diode, cathode, triode, anode? Is that it? Correct. All right, well, thanks very much. Can we continue now? What is the next one? Which was the best video game released in 2014? Get... Kind of drawn. Gonna be realist. Started my future, okay? 
I don't care if you think I'm incorrect. That's your opinion. What is my favorite thing to do? Contemplate the human condition. Uh, bathe in deer blood. You do a lot this one. I'm gonna be real. All right, glad we're correct on that one, to be honest. What now? The test is now complete. Thank goodness for that. Well, where do we go from here? All these questions, your results are very helpful, I guess it's gonna say. Thank you very much. Your participation was adequate. Wow, okay. There are no more tests. We are done here for now. So wait, what happens in the future? Is there gonna be more tests? I don't know. I'm so sick of watching, I want to start participating. The freak. What does that even mean? This is weird. Goodbye. All right, well, take care. <laughs> Closes my game down. Well, there we go, guys. That was a game called the Watson Scott Test. I have no idea where this game even came from, but the idea behind it is so similar to like, you know, simulacra stuff like that. Very interesting stuff. This game though made me feel extremely uneasy throughout. There was so much weird stuff going on that like, I don't know where it was going to turn to, but it was fascinating. And I'm glad I played this one. I'm glad you guys recommended me to check it out. As for this game though, guys, I don't really know what else to say. It was just more of an experience where you're in the zone answering the questions and I guess getting the responses from whatever it was uh, based on what you say. But there we go anyway, guys, that was the Watson Scott test as a whole. Hopefully you guys don't mind how I sound right now. Like, I really don't know when I'm going to get better. And it's at this point where it's just like, I want to make content, so I'm doing it. Though I am starting to feel a little bit strange and a bit wheezy, so it's probably best to end the video here, and I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, why not drop me that like crane? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I, of course, hope you did enjoy, and I will, of course, see you on the next one. I'm going to be sick right now. <laughs>